Hey guys, today we are doing home improvement. As you see, we have a can of paint. We have our painting supplies. We are gonna paint this nasty floor out here by the pool area. I know I mentioned it a while ago. So we're painting it today. Hey, YouTubers! Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Got my painting hat on. This is actually my working hat. So whenever I'm outside, I put this on. Nice hat. Don't judge me. So also don't judge this thing. All right, so our screen broke. Oh my God, this house is a mess. But we're getting it fixed soon. This morning we woke up, we washed, we swept, and we cleaned as much as we could these floors. So I think they're ready, it's dried, and now we're gonna paint. We did a super good job of cleaning this up. This was, this was filthy. It had mildew stains. It actually looks good now, we should leave it. Uh, yeah. And all right, so you guys will see what it looks like when it's done. I think I'm a little tan as well. Ow. Um, did I get farmer's tan? No, I didn't. All right, good. Hello. All right, so this is the progress thus far, which actually looks kind of good. You're doing an amazing job. All right, so I did my part of the painting, and then now he's doing his part, and he's almost finished. By the way, look at our cute little chair. We still gotta like furnish this area. But this is a cute little rug we found. And that's a cute chair that we found at the thrift store. We're thrift shoppers, okay? I ain't got no shame in my game because I used to think, oh, thrifting is so ratchet. But it's actually, you find some really good stuff at thrift stores. I just wanted to show you your progress so far. You got one little square left to do. And pretty much everything is finished. All right, finally done, and this is the finished product. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section down below. What do you think? <sighs> it looks good, but I feel like it needs one more coat. I know, painting sucks. I'm not looking forward to that one more coat. We'll see how it looks tomorrow if we can like... So what time? It took us like, like three hours? We started at three. No, yeah. I mean painting, and we started at three, took a tiny break because I had to run get more. And oh then, yeah, um, we had to go get more, we ran out of paint. But we started early this morning with like power washing the floor and, and sweeping it. And yeah. Everything. So that took a long time. Good job. Your day is off. Uh, welcome back. So we are at uh, Taco Tuesday at this really cool place called The Alchemist. I'm going to show it to you guys in a few minutes. But Taco Tuesday, margaritas, tacos, rice and beans, bon appetit. So this is The Alchemist. Look at the cool floor. Basically this is where him and I used to come and play. Harry Wait. Potter games. So it's not, it's not the Alchemist. It's um, oh yeah, it's like a little area. It's called Eucalyptus Gardens um, because of those trees. But the Alchemist is one of the coffee shops. But yeah, uh, we'll take you there right now. There's different little restaurants and coffee shops and it's stuff. This is the Alchemist in here. They have really good coffee. So we have come across this. Sorry, this cool. Um, Art piece. There's a train coming by. This cool art piece with Frida Kahlo and she has flowers. Real flowers. And now we have arrived at Boomerang. It's a thrift store. I told you guys yesterday that we do thrift shopping. We are here in the uh, neighborhood of Fort Lauderdale. It's called Wilton Manors. Alright, let's go in the thrift Gotta store. Check out this place. Boomerang. <clears throat> And they have kitties. Oh, they do have kitties for adoption. Uh, we came to a ice cream gelato shop. A very authentic Italian place here in Fort Lauderdale in the neighborhood, Wilton Manor. I got a Nutella. He got a, I got an empty oh, cup. He, he got an empty cup, but he finished it so fast. What the hell? I got... Really, did you eat mine? All right, so we just got home. We went to the P.O. box. Uh, to my P.O. box that um, I have and we just got this amazing package from Rich from Montana and he sent me some really amazing lanyards that him and his daughter both make and it was one for me and one for John let me show you the detail on these lanyards because they're amazing we can't now I feel like we have to book a Disney cruise right? Yeah. 
<laughs> I feel like we have to book a Disney cruise now just because these lanyards are amazing and I have to show them off on the ship. So him and his daughter sell these lanyards. Hold on, let me just set them up so you guys can see how cute they are. All right, so these are the two lanyards. Um, so I'm gonna take this one and John's gonna take that one. And so we have Sorcerer Mickey down this whole entire lanyard, so amazing. And in here we could put our key to the world card for the cruise ships. And in this one, it is a um, a Mickey, a Mickey, um, classic Mickey lanyard. And it's also super adorable. I love these so much. Rich and his daughter Jenna are selling these to make money so that they can purchase a Disney Dream Cruise. So they're trying to go on a Disney Dream Cruise. So uh, I'm going to put their link down below so you guys can go and purchase these lanyards. They are adorable. I can't wait to wear them. And Rich and Jenna, if you guys are watching, thanks so much. I love and these. And fast forward a few days later, I'm still doing this home vlog. Um, I just got home from work. As you can see, I came from London. Um, I didn't vlog in London. The weather was crappy in London. I didn't do anything in London, so I'm not holding out on you guys. I just didn't do much. Um, what's the matter? I think a lizard ran into the house, and he's literally looking for it right now. Here, let's see. What's in there? What's in there, Gio? What's the matter, Gio? It's not there. Crazy dog. All right, come on. Vamos. Come on, go. Come on, you can't be in here. Let's go. <laughs> Gio! Come on. Crazy. Okay, so, like I was saying, um, I got a few things in London. I got some hot cross buns from Waitrose. I also got these crinkle crunch ginger cookies. I'm really excited to try these. As well as scones. John loves scones. So I finally found them yesterday. They were actually very inexpensive. This Twinnings Cold Infused Tea, it is uh, watermelon, strawberry, and mint flavor. I'm excited to try that. One of my really awesome coworkers who I was working with today uh, bought me this clotted cream fudge. So it's really delicious, as you can see. I opened it already, trash. And these sugar cubes, which I think are super cute. So as you can see, screen still not repaired. I don't know when they're gonna come do it. Uh, this property manage management company is not the best had a very bad experience with them but the floor is looking nice and we have plants um, that is a soursop tree growing right there I also have a lemon tree and a guayaba tree and I'm back home from yet another trip I came home from Barcelona he's making some croquetas I bought these from Barcelona it's like a tapa style dish right and it has uh, sun-dried tomatoes and parmesan in it they're amazing we also bought churros and then I also bought this hot chocolate mix which Chocolate and churros is what you have in Spain. Also, I got this olive oil from Spain. And then we also got this batatas bravas, which is also a Spaniard dish. And Gio, what are you gonna have? <laughs> also, I purchased this tinto de verano, which I showed you guys in the um, Madrid vlog that I just recently did. So we're gonna have that for dinner as well. So dinner is served. <laughs> It doesn't look pretty. It doesn't look pretty. It's our Spaniard dinner. It doesn't look pretty, but I'm sure it's, it's yummy. And not only that, but we're having dinner on Spaniard time. It's 9.37 at night. Spaniard. Oh, that's true, it is, yeah. I had a flight, at, not a flight attendant, I had a passenger the other day because we served her dinner around 6 o'clock, 6.30 from here to Barcelona. She said, what time do you guys eat dinner in the States? I'm like, we eat dinner around 6, 6 o'clock, 6.30. She goes, really? I'm like, I know, you guys have dinner around like 9 o'clock. She's like, yeah. She's like, this is so weird, eating at this time. Isn't that funny? All right, so we just had our dinner, and now this one over here is like guarding his, don't mind our trash can. This one over here is like guarding his snackies and his food and his treats. Is that what you want? Do you want a snack? You want a snack? Oh, these are Gio's vitamins. These are his um, skin vitamins for his skin. Come on, Gio, let's face this way. All right, sit, good boy, E5. Good boy. Lay down. Yay, good boy. Do not run. All right, so, same thing. Sit, me a five. Good boy, lay down. Good boy. Hey, Jill, say hello to the camera. 
Diaz ahead of the camera. Yeah. And good morning, welcome back to another day here. Um, so, uh, as you guys know, I'm going on a cruise in the next few days. Today is uh, the 15th of August. And um, so, okay. I'm actually getting all like my camera equipment ready. Like this piece, this camera. Oh, wait. The cam well, the camera's charging, but this camera right here, I got it from this company who sent it to me, wanted me to review it. So, I'm going to be using it on the cruise. So it's gonna be it's basically like a GoPro camera All right next thing I gotta tell you guys is I didn't I tried ordering a brand new vlogging camera a DSLR like with better um, Camera capabilities and filming capabilities and I bought a microphone and I ordered this all last week on Amazon I don't know what happened with my Amazon account, but they kept canceling my order and canceling and canceling and canceling I don't really know what was going on. They said that it appeared that there was an unauthorized user. I'm like, no, there was no unauthorized user. I'm the one purchasing these items. I was getting so frustrated. I had to keep replacing these orders, kept calling Amazon customer service. No one could help me. Finally, I was able to um, get a hold of an account specialist who was able to clear my account. I don't know what was going on. My camera is supposed to show up tomorrow. And by the way, I'm leaving tomorrow on my cruise. I don't know what time it shows up. Hopefully it shows up before I head to the airport. I pray to God that my camera shows up before I head to the airport. I really wanted to use it on this cruise um, in Europe. I wanted to use it and show you guys brand new material with this camera. Um, I also purchased a brand new microphone for it. So it'll block out the wind. So I guess uh, stay tuned for the cruise and Europe vlogs and you'll see if I got that camera or not And I'm gonna end this vlog right here. Thanks so much for watching If you like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up If you like these like home vlogs where I do it over the course of a few days Give it a thumbs up Let me know in the comment section down below if you're not subscribed yet Make sure that you do subscribe and I'll see you guys on my cruise vlogs By the time you're watching this I'll probably be on the cruise So I will see you guys on the next video